Hi, I'm gonna show you how to make cinematics and cutscenes in Go.4.2 and consider subscribing, so let's dive in. So I've prepared a demo here and this is the abandoned spaceship demo, I'll link it in the description. So let's start by hitting the plus button or control A and searching for animation. And you want an animation player, add that. And down here the animation uh, will pop up and you wanna click on animation and new. And you can name this cutscene. And here you have your animation track and you can set this to let's say 10 seconds over here. And now we want something to animate so we can add a camera just the same way as we did with the animation player a camera 3d we don't want it as a child so we can move it up now we can open up the camera and select preview and change the transform to a position we want so i want to start over here in the forest so we will do that and now we can set the first keys so hit this key button and you create a track now we can go over to the 5 second mark and now we can move it to our second position you can create as many positions as you want I'm gonna put my second position over here and create new key for both the position and rotation and now we can move over to let's say 5.7 and create another one and create a new key there I actually want to move them, so I'm going to select them and move them to 10 second mark. And we're going to extend this to 15 seconds. Holding control and zooming out a little bit. And we're going to go to the 15 second mark and make another one. So I want it to go over here. And end over here, because this is really cool. So make our last key. And now we can preview it. So let's play it. Go to the start and hit play. I think that looks really good. Um, one thing I like doing, because you can see it has some rough edges. It doesn't look so smooth, right? And to fix that, you go to interpolate mode and you make it cubic. And making it cubic is this blue one and it's more smooth. So let's check that again. Makes all the corners smooth. I'm also going to show you now how to play the animation. So we're going to make a new script and in the script on the ready function, you can just drag in your animation player and dot play and brackets and then the animation you want. So we want, if we open it up again and we go to rename, we just copy this and paste it in. I usually get type hints for this, but it doesn't seem to want to work now. And now if we play, play the scene, it should just play the animation. And you can animate anything, like if you wanted to, you can e even animate the spaceship here if it's split up into parts but i would probably just animate that inside of blender but it's really good and easy to get your cutscenes working thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one